Everyone loves a good film and where better to watch your favourite movie than here at the Odeon Lux Leicester Square in London, the UK's first Dolby cinema. This historical cinema first opened its doors on Tuesday 2nd November 1937 for the screening of The Prisoner of Zendar and since then it has been host to over 700 European film premieres. The Odeon Lux Leicester Square provides 800 luxury seats with state-of-the-art Dolby technology to give you the very best cinematic experience in both picture and sound. But today, we're here to talk about sound. By using Dolby Atmos technology with 400 speakers in 120 different speaker locations and 10 miles of speaker wire, Screen One lets you really hear the film as the creator intended. So sit back, get comfy, and let's explain to you the amazing world of Dolby Atmos and Sony. Thank you. But to understand what Dolby Atmos is, we need to understand where cinematic audio started. Before Dolby Atmos, audio was recorded in what we call channels. It all started with one channel or speaker that supplied all the audio for your content. As you would imagine, this mono setup didn't really allow us to create depth, movement, or even separation of dialogue from the rest of the content. To help address this, we moved to a stereo format with speakers on either side of the screen. This allowed the sound to travel from front of you, from left to right, or right to left. It doesn't, however, help when the action is meant to move behind you. Surround sound enhances the experience by adding support for five channels, which allowed you to hear audio that can not only move from side to side, but also from front to back. When we moved up to seven channel system, we were more able to give you the illusion of movement by placing sound on either side of the viewer. Both these options are a much better experience than stereo. However, they still limit your sound to these specific channels. Your audio track moves audio by simply increasing or decreasing volume per channel to correlate with the action on the screen, but without precision as the speakers in the channel are all lumped together playing the exact same thing. Dolby Atmos, however, revolutionized sound by liberating it from the constraints of channels. We can now immerse the listener in audio from all sides and overhead. With precision control over individual sounds which can now be played and moved within a three-dimensional space by individually utilizing all speakers to play 128 individual audio tracks instead of limiting sound to traditional channels. This means that audio comes to life in a way that mimics what you would get in the real world. So now, when a helicopter flies on the screen, you are able to hear, or rather experience it, the way you would if you were standing there with the characters. As one of the world's leading content creators, Sony is able to use technology like Dolby Atmos to better realize our purpose, which is to fill the world with emotion through the power of creativity and technology. We are now able to shrink the space between reality and imagination by immersing you into a world of moving sound in the cinema or even in your home. Sony has a range of products designed specifically to recreate a Dolby Atmos cinematic experience. At the high end, this can be done with one of our AV receivers combined with a traditional home theater setup of speakers across the room and in the ceiling. While this setup is the best possible scenario for the home, we do realize that most people won't have the space for all the speakers that are required. So, to be able to bring Dolby Atmos to more and more people, Sony introduced a range of Dolby Atmos soundbars. Traditionally though, Dolby Atmos soundbars have purely relied on reflecting sounds from your walls and included upward firing speakers to bounce the sound from your ceiling. This last bit is done specifically to simulate the effect of having ceiling mounted speakers to lift up the sound. These upward firing speakers are very effective if you have a regular shaped room with a flat ceiling and empty walls. However, large light fixtures, exposed wooden beams or a slanted or very tall ceiling all reduce the Dolby Atmos effect. On top of that, your sofa, chairs and bookshelf all interfere with reflections. As a consequence, a bar that relies solely on this won't be able to fully replicate the cinematic experience we set out to deliver. You might think to yourself, so how can a soundbar recreate Atmos in my living room then? Well, this is where Sony's expertise comes into play. We developed something called the Vertical Surround Engine and Astro's Pro Front Surround. Both these technologies use Sony's decades of knowledge in the audio field while creating blockbuster movies and TV shows. Extensive testing on how things are supposed to sound have helped us deliver the best possible experience. We measured how sound from different locations are perceived by the human ears. After processing this from a wide range of possible locations, we were able to turn all of this data into our unique sound processing engines. As for Pro Fun Surround, does this for the horizontal sound field around you, while the Vertical Surround Engine does this for the height above. When you combine those, you have the capability to play sound anywhere in the room, exactly what you need for Dolby Atmos. This can be done with just forward-facing speakers or combined with upward-firing speakers. The technology brings out the maximum potential for each individual soundbar. 
That way, the helicopter can fly over your head, thunderstorms can roar through your room, but dialogue is clearly defined where the actors are on the screen. And because of our processing, we can recreate this effect with all our Dolby Atmos soundbars, from the engine model all the way to the flagship. Sony's technology allows you to be fully immersed in your content and be moved by every bit of emotion, a true Kando experience.